Yo guys, in this GTA Online video, I will be showing you some of the best methods that you guys can be doing it to make loads of money in GTA Online. As always, if you guys are going to enjoy this video or find it useful, make sure to leave a like because it really does help me out. And without any further ado guys, let's jump straight into the video. So going ahead and starting things off with the first money method for this video, we do in fact have auto shop contracts. To be able to start these contracts up, you guys will first of all need an auto shop. If you guys want to go ahead and purchase an auto shop for yourself, you want to first of all go over to the internet browser and then from here select the Mays Bank foreclosures website. On this website we can purchase any one of the auto shops it doesn't really matter which one and after doing that you guys can then start up any one of the contracts. Now that we have this auto shop we can go ahead and go up these stairs and then head over to this contract board. You guys can see in the gameplay that I already have the super dollar deal selected and this will give me a whole payout of 185k. The best part about all of these contract type of missions is that you guys can do them all solo. In each one of these individual contract missions there is actually two setup missions that you guys will need to do before you guys can do the main type of heist or contract and get the total amount of money. These setup missions take roughly around about 10 minutes to complete and these setup missions will pay out a total of $10,000. But now skipping ahead to the final contract mission, one thing that you guys can do on specific contract missions is drive over to any garage that you guys own and then you guys should be able to enter on foot. This will mean that any vehicle that you guys have in that garage, for example an Epressor Mark II, you guys will be able to pull this out and then just complete the whole contract. Now like I just said guys, this only works on certain contract missions, for example this one right here which is the super dollar deal, it will work on this. But that is just really a handy tip to know if you guys are going to do these contract missions more often, this will just save you guys a bunch of time. But right here guys, we just went ahead and completed this contract and we did get rewarded with 166k. The reason we only got got 166k is because of the cuts but because we got 10k for both of the setup missions as well it does actually make up for them cuts so yeah guys i would highly recommend that you do this this can get you guys a lot of money quite quick and these contract missions don't have a cooldown on them as well which means after completing one of these contract missions you guys can go straight back to that contract board and then just start another one up but now guys we'll be going ahead and moving on to the next money method for this video and this will be the nightclub passive income now the nightclub altogether really becomes more effective with the more amount of businesses you guys own. For example, if you guys own every single business in the game like I do, not only will you be able to operate them businesses separately, but you guys can also get passive money from these businesses as well through the nightclub. As long as you guys have all of the technicians or even just a few of them, you will be able to assign these technicians to each one of these businesses and then they will occur some goods. We can see on the homepage of the nightclub, my warehouse earnings altogether is around about 54 million dollars and that is all purely from afk in and just leaving this nightclub to do its own thing and even right now i just have 330k just sitting there in my nightclub and that is all from just playing gta online altogether passive money at the nightclub is just really good and if you guys have around about two or three businesses altogether i would try and get this set up but now guys moving on to the next money method for this video we do have dr dre contract missions you guys will be able to access these missions through your agency and if we go ahead and log on to this computer here you guys can see that we do have the VIP contract. After playing through most of these contract missions you guys will finally get to the finale of these contracts and when you guys complete the finale you will be rewarded with 1 million dollars. My personal favourite thing about the agency altogether is that it does have multiple things to earn you guys some money. Obviously we have the Dr Dre contract missions which is great but alongside that we also have security contracts which can also get you guys a lot of money. Now these security contracts really do vary in the amount of money that you guys can make from them. It is anywhere between 30 to around about 70k altogether. To get these security contracts started faster I would recommend that you guys just phone up Franklin instead. This will give you guys the ability to start one of these contracts anywhere on the map. One more thing that ties into this as well is also the payphone hits. All of these payphone hit missions are really fun to do as well and they can also get you guys a ton of money. So in my opinion the agency as a whole is just really good to make you guys some quick money in GTA Online and maybe if you guys have the chance to pick up a free agency in one of the event weeks or even a discounted one I would definitely try and get that. But moving on to the next money method for this video guys we actually have the casino heist. Now the casino heist has always been a really good way to make some really fast money in GTA Online. You guys can also do the replay glitch if you really wanted to as well. Doing that back to back with a friend or somebody else will save you guys so much time and also make you guys so 
much money as well. The Casino Heist is something that I will always recommend that to players who want to get some money fast and it is also definitely worthwhile doing. But now guys moving on to the final and probably the best money method for this video we do actually have the KO Perico Heist. What makes the KO Perico Heist so effective and good is that it does have a very similar payout to the Casino Heist, sometimes even a lot more as well and the fact that you guys can do all of the KO Perico Heist solo just makes it in my opinion so much better than the Casino Heist. And because this is a heist there is also also a way to replay the heist as well so in my opinion this is just a no-brainer to make some really easy money in GTA Online. The only requirement that you guys will need for the KO heist is just the submarine but when you guys have that you are literally set for any one of these heists but anyway guys that is going to do it for this video this is really the main type of methods I would use to make loads of money in GTA Online right now. Now all of these methods can change depending on the event weeks we have for example if there's some double money or even triple money on some crates or something like that but as of right now this is probably my favorite thing to do but anyway guys if you did enjoy this video or find it useful make sure to leave a like it really does help me out and i really do appreciate it and if you guys are new to the channel and like what you see make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications to never miss a video finally guys stay safe and thanks for watching